What's going on gamers, DBM Gamer here. Uh, what you're checking out here is uh, footage from the new Destiny game, and that's kind of what I got on mind. That's what I want to talk about today. Uh, but before I get into that, I want to get some shout outs uh, taken care of, knocked out. Uh, first off, I want to give a shout out to uh, Owen UK Hero for uh, giving me a sub, uh, the spammer <laughs> for giving me a sub, and uh, GT Real Auto for also uh, dropping me a sub. I appreciate that, guys. It helps this channel grow. I also want to give uh, shout outs to uh, Adam Vaca, Victor Valiant, and uh, Warthog2022 for uh, dropping comments for me. So today, uh, I was sitting at work in my break room, having a migraine headache, not having a good morning. So I grabbed my little smartphone, and I'm, I'm flipping through the news, and I noticed that they've given the uh, the budget for the Destiny game. And I'm, I'm pretty interested in Destiny, so yeah, I clicked on the link to see what's going on. And I read that CEO Bobby Kotick said that they were ready to drop 500 million dollars on this game let that sink in for a second 500 million dollars that's half a billion dollars to put that in perspective for you the most expensive video game that's ever been made considering development cost uh, marketing advertisement it's been grand theft auto 5 uh, and the rockstar spent uh, i think about 260 million on that title Five hundred million dollars. That's almost twice. That is insane. <laughs> uh, Grand Theft Auto Five. Okay, let's put that in perspective. Grand Theft Auto Five. One, two, three, four. We're on the fifth one. So we're talking an established franchise that's been around for a while. Uh, everybody kind of knows what to expect, what they're buying. Um, and then here comes along Bungie's Destiny. Now Bungie, don't get me wrong. Bungie's an outstanding uh, company. They've uh, been responsible for the Halo games. Um, if you've had Xbox, you've had the joy of experiencing those. They're, they're, they're top-notch titles. Uh, I've tried them, and they're pretty good. Um, but Destiny, no one's played it. No one's tried it. No one knows really anything about it. Uh, other than the little trailers that they're dropping here and there. Uh, kind of like the one that you're watching right now. Um, and Bungie is slowly but surely leaking out little details here and there. And they've already said at D3 uh, they're going to be there. Uh, and they're going to have a, a big drop, uh, I guess, during Activision's press conference there. But, um, yeah, man, $500 million. That's that's a lot to make up. Um, let's, let's think about it like this. Okay, currently right now there are 7 million PlayStation 4s that have been sold. Uh, I think Xbox Ones, they're sitting on about 5 million shipped, probably 4 million sold. So, uh, and I've, Bungie's Destiny is supposed to drop uh, September 8th, I believe, is their release date. So you're not talking too far away. So if you just kind of take a guess at how many more units, game, uh, console units that we're going to sell between now and then, you're saying, what, roughly 10 million PlayStation 4s, maybe 8 million uh, Xbox Ones. So you're looking at maybe 18 million uh, consoles. In order for uh, Activision to get their money back out of uh, Destiny, with, if they're talking about spending $500 million, you're talking that they're going to have to move somewhere between 15 to 16 million copies of this game. Damn, that's a lot. <laughs> um, for somebody that's, for, for them to be banking on it that hard, that's something, I don't know, man, that's, that's a, a pretty crazy number. Analysts are uh, predicting that they're only going to move about $8 million, so they're really going to be leaning on the last gen on this game. So uh, one thing that I would like to encourage everybody to do, if, if they're planning on dropping this much money on it and they've got that big of a faith or that much faith in it, that uh, they're having a beta. The beta is supposed to drop in July. So what I would recommend is getting access to the beta. Now, what's the easy way to get access to it? Because it's going to be exclusive. There's only one, really one way that it's known that you can get your hands on it. And that's to pre-order the game. Now, one trick that you can do, uh, you can go on Amazon.com, order the game there. Uh, they'll give you a pre-order code, then you can cancel your pre-order, not a dime spent. Uh, me, myself, personally, I plan on running down to my local GameStop and uh, pre-ordering it, trying the beta out, seeing what I think of it. And I, if, I, you know, if I think it's poop, I'm just going to get my monies back out of it. But uh, most likely, I'll probably be keeping this one. If it's, if it's what I think it's going to be, or what I hope it's going to be, I think we're in for a fun ride on this one, guys. Uh, but anyway, I'm out of here as always. Have a good one. <laughs>